The problem has been that I have not been rattling my good luck charm before going into the run. Now that the good luck charm has been properly rattled, we are going to truly be the successful ninjas, the most incredibly unstoppable practitioners of the dark arts all time certainly not going to humiliate myself anymore i mean kind of appreciating like just cutting the video when i die because <laughs> it's i think it's funny so that it justifies the low duration it's like there's something about it that cracks me up just the video ends when i explode <laughs> so you know there's no ulterior motive though it really does help you know with my recent troubles of being able to produce constantly maybe for just a little while i can reduce the length of the videos a little bit you know when it's when it's pertinent when it's something that is maybe maybe a funnier alternative let's grab this turkey because we are here to give you turkeys i don't want to i don't want to do violence against them i should be able to just ride it and then turn it in right there you go because they did not register the fact that i came in here with a dumbass turkey oh yo we got ourselves some rope i would really like those spring shoes but you know there is a whole hostile piece of garbage up there thing is pretty certain you can just go back there and murder him as long as you trigger the vandal uh the vandal message well your turkey be dead <laughs> i cannot turn this in he's going to be so mad if i do so let's do a plan b here oh well he does get mad if you throw a bomb at him maybe i can time this so perfectly i did not time it perfectly <laughs> look look Violence is in my blood. If I cannot murder the shopkeeper, somebody's gotta pay. Just like when I refrain from beating my children, the wife's gonna get it, right? It's just the way it has to be gone, be, be done. Otherwise, otherwise, not everything is right in the universe. Just witness the absolute cold, cold blood and murder of that rat and i'm say cold-blooded not because he was particularly calculating but simply because he was done by a cold-blooded animal i hope that you got that pun if not i'm going to explain it to you in the next and you know in the previous minute or so i have explained it to you and now it is properly explained i have explained the joke that makes it funnier there you are i'm of the norm mcdonald school of thought you explain the joke, you make it funnier. I think my delivery is, is probably way better than his, though. He was kind of a hack. That uh, old lump of coal. He was nothing compared to my incredible comedic timing. Let me just uh, get the hell out of here. Through this garbage. Get myself rocked in the head. All right, not. Not today, Martha. That is the name of the rock, if you can catch it. Okay, there's nothing to be gained by going to that shop. It is full of garbage. Looks like I have gone to a China Mart. Uh, oh, oh, oh! I am thinking. Um, I am thinking about the previous run. We do need to go in there because you see. Well, <laughs> this is not the plan. But well, here's something that we can do. I want to destroy your shield, buddy. You're really intent on following me, huh? Hmm. There's no escape. It's going to chase me no matter what. I have very much ruined my ability to flee this place. What? Who? What? I was pressing the wrong button. 
I couldn't run because I pressed the wrong button. My pinky shifted when I went at the... My pinky shifted when I went up the rope. I was no longer pressing shift. Because, you know, I am a, a keyboard chad. Not one of those silly controller versions. So I use the keyboard to control this video game. Alright, let me just get the dim shop. This time around, we're going to grab and go. Okay, he's not going to even have time to shoot me in the back. Oh, baby. Alright, alright, alright. We're good, we're good, everything's fine. Holy crap. Oh, may we witness his demise? Even better, we sacrifice the crap out of him. And like I said, as long as you get the Vandal trigger, quite certain Sparrow is still down with your number. He, she just doesn't care. All she gets is that signal that you managed to steal. If later you turn out to be a violent criminal, she's perfectly okay with you. We only have four bombs. So I don't think it's worth spending one. Going down there, what we're gonna do is get this Kapala. Then simply carry the key all the way to the bottom. Hopefully there is an opening. We get another shotgun. It's been quite a while since I played the game. I have a shotgun in my hands, buddy. You didn't need to use that rope. I mean, I was like, ah, there's a there's a rope up there. So I can spin a rope to get it, right? It was a good value. Could have done even better. Really should be murdering some freaking moles just for their blood and get myself all nice, hale and hearty. Ooh. We have a cape. Let's remember we have a cape. Ah, this ninja saga is now two episodes longer than I thought it would be. But it's okay, I forgive myself. You cannot forget how actually difficult freaking Spelunky 2 is. It is so much... I am so much less reliable playing this game. I want to spin a rope here. Let's put this down. Murder the filthy spider. Not a Kali instance. We don't really... Oh, well, this was not the sparrow spawn. My bad. <laughs> I think she needs to spawn in the next bio, right? She does not come into the mines. She does not care. Uh, this filthy, lowly dwelling's place. Pretty sure this is true, but you know, we, we're cautious around these parts. We take great care to always be sure the traps are well and truly disarmed. We shoot you in the friggin' back. Give myself some extra money. Something we do want, though, is forgiveness. We're not going to do any more violence against these lunatics. Oh, that's right! Finally, my revenge! Destroy! And, you know, I call it revenge like he has done anything unprovoked to me. I realized that every violent interaction was started by my side, but I don't care! He ended my life and therefore his must also come to an end. This poor bastard. It's fine, he's going to be revived in the next instance of, the, of these uh, terrible holds of despair. I would like to steal all that stuff, but I think that is way too much work for my bridges. Let me just put a bomb right here. We're going to make ourselves a shortcut so I can simply leave. The moment that he's climbing that ladder, just get the hell out of here. That was a little closer than I was comfortable with, but it's alright. Oh man, it takes me back. Going through the dwellings 70 times in a row, barely seeing any other biomes. It's like uh, we are back in uh, 2022 and I'm learning the freaking video game again. I think the Plunky 2 came out in 2021, right? It's pretty damn crazy to think that it's been so long. Let's go back to the jungle because I kind of hate Volcano. I, I just kind of hate it. I don't really hate it. I just. You know, I, I got an overload of Volcana so hard during my Cosmic Ocean days. I'm like, let me just go jungle. If I get a choice, I'm going to go to the jungle. Have a, a more fun time. Even though it does mean, on average, it's going to be more difficult. I still would rather go here. Okay, bud. 
You put yourself down there. I will call upon you if we ever need sacrificial flesh. Otherwise, just stay down there. You may carry a clone gun for me at some point. Out. Be careful, though. We shun the shoe and reject saving any kind of innocent animals now that we don't no longer need them. Let me do murder upon you. Grunk, you're, you're becoming a little bit of a problem here. If you do not desist on your adventurous escapades, we, I'm, going, I'm going to have to do without you. Woohoo! We'll have a spike shoes here, so got to be a little bit careful. That being said, it's great payoffs where health is concerned. You can never have enough slaves. If that's something that Derek Q has taught me. You can never have enough slaves. You could always do a plus one on your slave count. I think that's a famous quote from George Washington. Holy crap, almost got murdered by a plant. We just shoot down range, destroy everything that moves. Another famous quote by George Washington. He was mostly talking about escapees. Let me get the hell out of here. There's two slaves up there. Ready to do my bidding. Get rid of this filth. Alright. Two live slaves, baby. Alright, we got our sparrow nonsense. Now. Let me just put you fellas to sleep. I mean, you're not, you're going to be rowdy, you're going to want to escape and all that. Your friend, how about you learn from Grunk 1, the OG, and you stop moving around. Oh, this is freaking uh, silly ass. That a restless kind of thing. Let me actually explore it a little. Because I think that's the entrance to the black market. No, but it is the entrance. I only have six bombs. Eh, let's just do it. I'm too freaking lazy. I'm too lazy. We're just going to go in through here. Save the vegetable lady. For all. And it is the black market. No, yeah, yeah, there is the black market down there. Uh, looks like the entrance to the black market will be far to the, far to the left here. And up. Let's have it in mind. We are cautious, we advance with care, we do not take chances. Very close by. Okay. <laughs> Better you than me, buddy. There you are. That was the trained one, too. These damn slaves, man. Just can't rely on them. Just gotta do everything myself. Alright, we're good. Give me that clover. Might as well grab all this cash. Look at all this cash. Damn, that's a lot of cash. More wonderful hired hands. I hire them with my whip. That is the price I pay. A little bit of elbow pain as I crack it. I am rich. I am famous. I buy things, don't even bat an eye. That's 10,000 for a bunch of bombs. Very much tempting. You know what's even more tempting? 20,000 for this jet. It's gonna happen, baby. Who needs bombs when you can fly? I was hoping for a little bit more cash, so maybe I can afford both. Like I said, I want to concern myself with uh, violent interactions with these buffoons oh yeah jetpack me baby all right uh could I maybe find eight thousand dollars just laying about somewhere maybe even spend some bombs at it i think this this can be close to it between these two. Oh yeah eh i mean if i i'm kind of committed now i need to find the cash so we're going to try and do it just the conventional way, just traversing the level, getting ourselves a little bit of gold nuggets here and there. Because I am uh, 
very much interested in having an extra pile of money. Why am I staying so close? That is foolishness. Almost there, buddy. No, okay, so we get a little bit of extra health. Uh, here's uh it should be a, that should be it. Look at me being diligent. Playing the game as intended instead of being a freaking lunatic maniac and just spreading death wherever I go. Playing within the systems of the game. That's me. You can rely on me to play by the rules. Give me these bombs. They're mine now. They mine. All right, we go down all the way to the bottom. Slaves in tow. We are very... Slow and careful with freaking insta death bear traps. Okay, fellas. I want you fellas to just lay down here, be quiet, be peaceful. I'm not even gonna bother to go in there with that mad talk nonsense. I am sick of it! Death, death, death. Everything dies. 18 points of health. I think we're good with the with the health collection. He said, "Wild thirsting uh, after those blood pellets." All the same. You go your way. I'll go mine. Rat face. I'm not interested in antagonizing you either. I was very upset. <laughs> what, what what am I doing? <laughs> you just. I got a freaking brain fart just now. Alright, go through that. Go through that terrible gauntlet. I am very mad. <laughs> the, the... The... Configuration of these damn... What are you doing? I just put you to sleep, you buffoon! <laughs> How stupid are you? Oh... Man, you're dumb. The one idiotic pile of rocks. Huh? I mean, you want to explore these, right? You like to... I like to see what's in here. Oh, uh, well... Just put me upside down, tar my ankles, call me Mary. How do you dare sell me a jet? I mean, it's still freaking insanely expensive. Why Why you tempt me like this? No, I have a mission. I'm going to do this mission. One of these days, we're going to actually make it to the tide pool. It would be great to see Olmec. It's been a while. Death upon you. We are not doing that kind of gameplay today. No plasma cannon for me. No antagonizing rat face. That's not gonna happen. Trying to tempt me just Derek with his dastardly level generation giving me the most tempting things he can possibly conceive. But no! I turn you, I shun you away! Big on, demon! Tempt me not with the fruit of your forbidden tree. Give me some bombs, baby. I'm not even shooting these women in the face. That's what I told the judge. Because I am a law-abiding citizen. Alrighty. Okay, this is good. Ah, good old Olmec encounter. Look at me! <laughs> that was a little too generous. Of a uh, step into all mixed bath. Um, look at me. Look at me playing vanilla Spelunky, doing the vanilla Olmec fight. Olmec, this is his pre depressive era. era. No sadness detected. It's all bright and ready to destroy Spelunky's crushing beneath his mighty cheeks. Get a massive level of sexual arousal when he does that. Good old times. We're gonna travel back in time. Rediscovering the intricacies of Spelunky 2. It is just shameful for me. Shameful, I say. The fact that I never actually completed this quest line. I just, I was not aware of its existence. Uh, or rather, I didn't realize it went that far. All this time I thought, oh yeah, of course I did the Sparrow thing. I stole Tusk's idol from 
What's it called? From uh, tide pool. That's all I had to do, right? Yeah, of course. Never again. Touched it. I hate these damn aliens. I hate them. Money for? I mean, I still have a reason to buy money to get money. There's, n it is not gratuitous money collecting, even though that's the reason why I do it because I like the shinies. I am a massive gold digging whore, and I'm going to grab all this money, whether it's pointless or not. I like number go up. I enjoy that. So, you know, who's gonna stop me? You? You're in the future, you idiot! <laughs> I dwell in the past, safe from your influence. There's nothing you can do to stop me. I am the master of my present domain. I bet it rankles your feathers. I bet you're like just now trying to invent time travel just to teach me a lesson in humility. You're about to pop in a vortex right next to me. I consider in the back of my head, like, doing the bit, like, actually committing to that bit and pretending like somebody just popped next to me, but then I was like, oh, it's just it's so much work. I'm not even gonna do that. <laughs> it's just silly. How are you just imagine it? Imagine that I just did that. That is just as good, right? That is what stand-up com comics do. Imagine I just told you 20 jokes, now give me the money. Oh, I guess they already paid. The audience already paid. So they don't even have to try, right? That's what stand-up comedy, comedy is all about. Getting the entrance fee and then just telling people to go home because you already have their money. What are they going to do about it? Bitch about it on, on the internet. See who cares. People will probably will just comment 20 times in a row based. And you'll get another recording deal or something. Huh? I don't think there's anything to do here. Right? Go. Death, destruction. Yeah, there's nothing to do here until you come across Tusk. And what you want to do with Tusk, and that reminds me, maybe what we do want to do is maybe find a key in about somewhere. It's pretty nice to find this. Oh, get mad! Get mad, you idiot! Tripped on your own rock! What an absolute idiot! It sucks to be you, dumbass! I'm all about stealing honorably until my target cannot defend himself and then I am a total scumbag. Didn't we have a shotgun at some point? Did I just leave it behind? Maybe I put it down. I think I put it down just to steal a dog. I just, I just stole this man's dog and I feel no shame about it. Well, joke's on me because I have no idea where I left my shotgun so, you know, uh, who's the fool now? Who's the fool now? I'm the fool. Let's get out of here. It's fine, we'll find another one. And if not, I'll need it anyway. I have my bare two hands. They are registered lethal weapons. You, have you seen the mask I wear? I'm a ninja. I'm just gonna bomb this nonsense. Ooh, there it is, right? No. I was about to say, oh, Madam Tusk. There you are, my mark. with you and this challenge I will certainly do do we still have a slave or are they just dead forever oh that's right I put them in a sacrificial altar right before they could have fulfilled their purpose <laughs> that's just the way I roll my bloodthirst got the better of me it's not my fault I just follow my inner impulses uh, there's more more torches there's supposed to be more torches I just dropped the one that I was holding. There's another torch right there. Okay, more cash. I like this torch better. It smells better. That's a nice piney scent. Okay, here's the clone gun. We'll juggle it here and there. And the way this one works, they can be aggroed, but it's far more elegant if Madame Tusk is not even aggroed. Let me put this next to the exit. We do have a crown. So we can, in fact, carry everything here. But do I even want to? 
sword is fun. I've always liked it. We have plenty of health too, so we can spare a few hits from the giant fish. You idiot! Come on here. There you go. <laughs> Machete, huh? How exciting. Gronk. We shall take let that. Leave that. Oh, the sword. Well done. We're done. Oh, that's right. You can't hold on to ledges underwater. You're not gonna let go of that sword, are ya? I can... I trust you. Famous last words. Where does this go? Oh, it just connects to this area. All right. That's funky. Oh, man. He, he actually found the way here. They usually get... Kind of get stuck in uh, underwater. I am impressed. He was able to make it all the way down there. All right. Madam Tusk should be around the corner. I really don't trust you with that sword, bud. You're going to suck ass with it. Holy crap, man. <laughs> you could easily just kill me with that attack. Destroy, destroy. Might as well get a pile of health. All right. So, we have no real means of opening that. We need to either find the skeleton key, whoop, which is, you know, very, very unlikely, or we find ourselves, find ourselves uh, a regular iron key. Hate you. Hey, Gronk, dispatch this for me. Well done. Well done. Great teamwork. What's up, buddy? And you can still, you can still play this. They don't exclude one another. Oh, that's right. You have to actually pay to pay to play. What is this? An Activision game? Freaking gacha. Forcing me to pay an entrance fee. I hate this. I'm actually wasting a lot of time here. But hey, maybe she'll produce a skeleton key to steal her wares. That'll be pretty hilarious. She must not die, is the thing. Ah, eh, did not get lucky. Please! Time is not on my side. Okay, we're good. No reason to grab any of those. Let's leave that clone gun up there. I'm hoping to find a key somewhere. Which can be needs to be carried from a different level. Probably should have kept... Holy crap, brother. Sure, I kept. I know that I found one in the distant past. We cannot kill Tusk. That is a necessity. How do you even make it there? I guess there was another path up there. Well, he's trapped there now, so we're we're keeping that sword no matter what. Hmm. Maybe we can. Maybe there's a path through the back layer. That is 100% possible. In fact, it's right here. Nah. I was hoping. Yep. I don't have here. I don't see anything here. <sighs> this is uh, where I fail miserably. I mean, obviously, I'm going to, at the last resort, shall be aggroing. These buffoons, the the body guard can die. Well, my key is forever gone. I mean, my uh, hired hand is forever gone. And because uh, Madam Tusk is now dead, my entire mission is over. Kind of. Uh, Educational, though. There's a reason why I never actually won this mission. And that is, it's actually difficult. And not just that, you may get boned by the level generation and possibly your failure to... Failure to understand that, hey, you actually need to plan this. You can't just assume it's gonna work. So I guess now I'm just stuck here. 
There's no keys. There's nothing to be done. That damn stupid ass piece of garbage. I mean, there is a key right over there. We can grab. Grab it. I hate this. I, I hate everything about it. I hope that is clear. <laughs> damn freaking ghosts. Hopefully they won't split an another time. Let's wait here. Don't split, you weird, you pieces of garbage. <laughs> I hate everything about you. Oh! <laughs> the four ghosts are too much for me to deal with. The, the pair of ghosts, it's, you know, it's manageable. It's difficult as hell. I'm mostly done, they're gonna get me. Oh, that's right, I, I have no, I have no jetpack. The saga continues. What you want me to say? It is actually a difficult mission.